Thanks for joining us. The alleged catch me if you can copycat is luring in yet another alleged victim. This time she's out thousands, but thankfully Zachary Bailey wasn't able to get his hands on her 2018 Range Rover. A case federal agents are now looking into. News Force Kaylee Olivas is back on the story tonight. Cases are stacking up against Zachary Bailey. Two more were just filed in Oklahoma County Court. Meanwhile, up here in Osage County, another one is about to be filed by a mom who says she was conned out of thousands of dollars. <laughs> he got me. Chrissy Newbold, a mom who just wants to live a simple life. Now caught up in a spider web of investigation into 19 year old Zachary Bailey, spun by the U.S. Secret Service. He's been continuing through his wife since he's been locked up. He's not stopping. He has not learned his lesson. He's he's just a con artist. Zachary Bailey arrested two weeks ago in Apache for allegedly trying to defraud a Metro dealership out of $111,000. Since then, he's been charged with two more felonies of deception, one for reportedly trying to make off with a Lamborghini and another for a Trans Am. Now he's on the hook for wire fraud in several different cases, one being with Newbold. He contacted me through Facebook Marketplace and said that he and his wife would like to look at my vehicle. But he couldn't wait and agreed to wiring her $45,000 for it. And Newbold would give him seven grand to pay off the rest of the loan. It was pending on Wells Fargo until the next morning and Friday morning, it showed there was a zero balance and the account was closed. But three days after that, the money was returned. She had already sent $2,300 over third party payment apps to Bailey and his wife. Money she has yet to get back. Luckily, Bailey never got a hold of her 2018 Range Rover because he ended up in jail before he could. She immediately called several different law enforcement agencies and ended up connecting with a Secret Service agent last week. He said, well, this is a second Range Rover. You're the second Range Rover victim that's going on right now. That agent allegedly telling Newbold they're also looking into Bailey's 16 year old wife and 74 year old father. But she says she wants to continue burying this family in charges, so she'll be pursuing legal action soon. We're making contact with Secret Service to see if they're going to handle the entire case or if we're going to go ahead and prepare an affidavit and seek charges in state court for the for the fraud here. In Osage County, Kaylee Olivas, Oklahoma's News 4. Bailey is still locked up in the Oklahoma County Jail this afternoon. He did call our reporter Kelly Olivas last night, but he did not leave a voicemail and has not called back today.